Hello everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this part of the series we are going to summarize what we have covered in the previous videos by creating a simple project and it's a dimmable LED. So we'll be able to change the brightness of an LED using the potentiometer which we have talked about in the previous video. So if you didn't watch the previous videos go ahead and check them out and let's jump right into it. So first of all we need to connect the components in our project. Basically you will need an LED, the ohm resistor and of course the potentiometer. We are going to connect all of these to the Arduino. Then we are going to write the code. So I highly recommend you to stop the video and start connecting the LED using one of the digital pins. Then you need to connect the potentiometer like we have done in the previous video. After that try to write the code that is going to read the value from the potentiometer and adjust the brightness of the LED using the analog write command but you need to pay attention so the value that we are going to read from the potentiometer is between 0 and 1023 but the analog write command takes a value between 0 and 255 so you need to convert the value using the rule of 3 so make sure to pause the video then come back so I hope you have done that. So let's go ahead and connect the LED. So I'm going to use one of the digital pins, but make sure to use the one that has the squiggly sign. That's because we are going to use the analog write command and it only works when we use the digital pins that has the squiggly sign. For example, let's select the pin number three, zero, one, two, three, which is this pin. Then let's use this uh, green LED, you could use the red one. I'm going to connect the longer leg of the LED to the digital pin. And let's go back to the ground. I'm going to connect the shorter leg of the LED to the ground. But we have one problem, this LED can be damaged by the 5 volts that is generated by the Arduino. So we need to connect in series the ohm resistor. I've actually made this mistake. So we need to connect the digital pin to the ohm resistor. Then let's connect the longer leg of the LED. And finally we need to go back to the ground. And this is the circuit that we have created in the previous videos. Then let's go ahead and connect the potentiometer. And it's very simple. So let's put it in these points. So first of all, we need to go from the 5 volts pin to the first leg of the potentiometer. Use the one that is on the right side. Then we need to connect the left leg of the potentiometer to the ground. So we have here these ground pins as well. I'm going to use this one. And finally we need to connect the middle leg to one of the analog pins so that we can read the voltage. I'm going to use this jumper wire. And let's go to the pin A2. Now that we have connected all of the components, we need to write the code that is going to read the value from the potentiometer using this pin A2 and we are going to use it to change the brightness of this LED and to do that let's go back to the Arduino IDE first of all we need to add few variables for example we need to add the pin number 3 using int I'm gonna call it LED pin and let's assign the value 3 so we've used the digital pin 3 and we need to add another variable I'm going to call it read pin and it's the pin A2 then under the setup function we need to set the pin number 3 as an output and the pin A2 as an input using the pin mode I'm going to pass in the LED pin and we're going to use it as an output to change the brightness of the LED then pin mode we use the pin A2 as an input 
Then under the loop function, each time we are going to read the value using analog read. Basically, we give it the pin number, which is read pin. And it's going to return the value from the potentiometer. But we need to store it in another variable. So let's go up here and use int. I'm going to call it read value. And let's assign it from here using read value equals analog read. Then we are going to use the analog write to change the brightness of the LED. So the first parameter is the uh, pin number, which is the LED pin. Then we need to pass in the value, which is going to be between 0 and 255. And I'm going to use the rule of 3 to convert the read value to another number between 0 and 255 using read value times 255 over the 1023. But we have one problem. We need to tell this program that these are floating numbers using the dot. Make sure to add that. Now we've completed the program. Let's review it again. So first of all, we've declared the pin numbers like the pin number 3 and A2. And under the setup function, we've used the pin LED pin as an output and the read pin as an input to read the value. Then under the loop function, which is called over and over again, so each time we read the value from the potentiometer, then we use it to change the brightness of the LED, and we've used the rule of three to make this conversion. Let's save the script or the sketch. I'm gonna verify it. So we didn't have errors, we can upload the code. And there you go, now we can change the brightness of the LED using this potentiometer. So it's working, now it's full brightness, and if we rotate it to the left, we could decrease the brightness. So I think that's pretty much it guys for this video. If you have any question or comment, make sure to write it under the comment section down below. Also make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel so that you get notified with my uh, videos, and I will see you in the next one.